Hello everybody, Extrasify here. Welcome back to another weekly mailbox cleanout. This is the third episode. Make sure to check out my other two weekly cleanouts to see what I sold. But without further ado, let's get into what I sold this week. So, with that out of the way, let's get into the mailbox. So, we sold a total of 366 mails this week. Our first 100 total is 155,066 gold. Now the things of note that I will quickly highlight is we sold an incised great sword, 2,500. I believe that's a Warlords of Draenor weapon, world drop. And then we sold the hardened obsidian shoulders and the vicious ornate pyrium shoulders. These are both cataclysm blacksmithing. I guess he wanted both of those. Let's see what else. Oh, we sold a Bleakwood Hue. That is a blacksmithing craft from Vanilla, I believe. Yeah, yeah, Vanilla. Uh, this one took me ages to sell, but it finally sold. I had it for 40300 before auction house fee. That one's very nice. We sold another Sunwell pattern. I'm telling you guys, anyone that doesn't think Sunwell is that great, please go farm it. I sell like two recipes a week and... As you can see, it's it's awesome, man. They sell very quickly and for a very good price. Aside from that, we got a Shadow Crescent Axe that is crafted. Some more crafted stuff. Uh, crafted leatherworking for in uh, Mr. Pandaria. Uh, blacksmithing Mr. Pandaria. That's a BFA weapon craft. Yeah, not too bad this week. Uh... We sold a frostbitten staff. That is from Iron Docks World Drop. Um, oh, we sold a bone plated set. That is um, in the Death Knight starter zone. There is a white gear vendor. And you can actually just buy a bunch of unique gear. And I guess someone wanted to, wanted to buy the set of that. So that's definitely awesome. Let's go ahead and loot this first 155,000 gold. And then we will get into what else we have sold. Another nice number coming up our way. I'll just wait until it refreshes. All right. And then the next 100 mails, we have 157,800 gold. Now this is pretty decent. Let's start off with another Sunwell pattern. I'm telling you guys, you guys got to check out my Sunwell farming video. I did a 50 run results, and these are some just some of the results you guys are seeing that I am selling through. Aside from that, we got the Grizzly Jerkin. This is from Black Fathom Deeps. Got a, about 9,500 9, gold. Sold some Ethereum Prison Keys from Mana Tombs. Some more crafted. More Ethereum Prison Keys. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. I didn't, I didn't realize that's old. Uh, so this is actually a toy from a rare spawn in the Zarlek Caverns. I was literally just doing some daily quests there, and I actually killed a rare, and it dropped the Din's drum. It literally just sum summons like a drum set. It's kind of obscure, but I cannot believe that sold for 83,000. <laughs> That's absolutely ridiculous. Wow. All right, I'll take it. Uh, yeah, a bunch of little filler transmog here. Dawnbringer shoulders from blacksmithing. A foul feather, I believe that's a pet. Um, some more crafted stuff. Hammer of the Titans, uh, crafted with blacksmithing and vanilla. Same with the golden scale coif. So yeah, not too bad. Uh, definitely, if I didn't sell that drum set, we would have a lighter purse in this 100 mail, but I'll happily take it. Oh wow. The last, or no, this next 100 is very, very, very nice. I'll just wait for this to refresh. All right, in this next 100, we have 259,838 gold. This is crazy. So there, there, yeah. Okay, I, I saw that we sold this. Um, I was really excited. So this is actually a trading card game pet. Um, I honestly don't remember when I got it. I just kind of had it in my pet journal and I must have bought it a while ago. I'm not sure, but I uh, decided to sell it and actually sold it for 200,000 minus the auction house cut 190. So 
quite pleased finding that in my journal. Um, we got Polar Boots, 6,500. That's Leatherworking Crafted. Uh, Rage Peep, sold that for 36, 3,700, essentially. Ice Bane Treads, more Crafted Leatherworking. This is a Magnificent Hide Pack. Is actually a Leatherworking Slot Bag from Mr. Pandaria. And I've realized that people don't like selling bags from professions and i've sold like almost half a dozen of these in like the past few weeks so i highly recommend that got more crafted stuff uh these handful of felt iron bolts if you haven't seen my top five vendor flipping video make sure to check that out that is from netherstorm um, you buy these for like silver and i sold 49 of them for 2000 gold some more crafted stuff very nice Okay, not too much here. Shadow Dust, Time Lost Scrolls. Saltstone Circo. This this price hurt me, man. Only 4700 That should be like a twenty to 30000 like every time. Um, that's about it with that clean out. Now let's loot all that. I honestly have no idea what will be in the last like 66 mails, so hopefully it's something good. I actually have no idea. I'll just wait for it to refresh. All right, another 15,000. Oh my God, those are so cheap. Anything of note here? Not really. Um, Matic Mechanical Dragon Link sold. Sandstalker Breastplate, that is crafted. Um, Short Staff is like a white weapon from vanilla. Nothing too much, so we'll take the last 14,000. And what does that leave us with for a total? Let's see. Oh, wow. All right. I will definitely take that. We ended this week's sale with 587,369 gold, meaning that we have now broken the 6 million gold threshold. 6 million and 69,000. Very nice. So very very pleased with that mailbox clean out i think that's the most we've gotten out of the first three videos so very very happy all right so aside from that that is all i have for today's video make sure to check out all my other content i make a ton of gold making videos for you guys to get rich in wow dragonflight uh, i appreciate all the support i've gotten lately it means everything and I got tons of videos coming, guys. Just keep keep watching. Uh, make sure to subscribe, like, comment, all that fun stuff. And until next time, good luck with your auction house sales. And I shall see you in the next gold making video.